is a machine gun, I'm a machine gun. It will have swapping over a period, like, but driving a car driver swapped over it so often, like, you'll just drive a vest and give a gun or a vest. And uh, anyway, it was my turn to fire a gun, and I was firing a machine gun, Brent will call it Brent gun, and uh, it was firing it beautiful. And so I said, come on, Bill, let it go, let it go, Bill, let it go, keep on going fast. And I'll, I'll, for, I'll, for God's sake, I'll be done deep nobody, I'll be done deep nobody. I was just in front of what I aim in it, this little long row edging, you know, with this big field. And I, I could see me, every fifth bullet, it's just a tracer, that tracer gives you an angle where you're firing it, you see. It's like lit up all the way to go in. You see, it says it went out every fifth bullet. Yeah, yeah. And uh, then, you know, you, you, you couldn't find a way you're aiming it, see. Yeah. And, uh, or you aim with, with this bullet, this cool bullet that finishes up. And it, it, it said, when it finished, it come out and said, that book, the government has got some stuff in there. I said, aye, well, it was very beautiful. <laughs> machine will like this. That's it. He says, keep them well oiled and they're all right, these machine guns. Big, powerful things they are. You, you don't carry them, they're passing on injured and like, you twist them and tilt them and blow them. But uh, you just rip finger press like this and stick it. And uh, he, he was a bit anxious, but I thought, I hope I'm not killing anybody with these bullets. They were back in my mind. Mm -hmm. It's not my nature to kill anybody, but you're there, and you've got to do that to keep yourself from getting killed. Yeah. It's a horrible feeling, back in your mind. So, yeah. Anyway, so far we didn't get killed. We got hurt twice, like, very hurt. And, and I was more scared than I'd ever been in my life, uh, until I got this dizzy spell. <laughs> yeah. uh, and uh, when it hit, this is a German AK enemy, it hit a little if it had been another yard this way, I would have to be here now. If it had been yard this way, and it hit Indian at the back of me, and I killed Indian dead. And so I said, bail out, bail out! I opened my eyes and went sideways. So I went that, that, no, I was that, that way. I went that way, and I went that, that way. And uh, we were set up on the sidewalk, just on the stand, while I stopped there following him. And he stood there well, going to go around him, and while I stopped him. Go set front to this edge bottom way, if this is what way. Come on, lads, come on, and just get down here. Shrunk down it, edge bottom. And one was the first aid down here, a couple hundred yards down here, just at the bottom of that field corner there, the first aid room here, and the little cottage. And who should we remember this kid from what? Eddie Clay. I know. And he said, There I come from Barley, brother, or what went for that effect, like I said, ah, where that comes from, I come from what? <laughs> Uh, we went, went twice, and that uh, we still don't know whether it's a not like it. It's a question of you, 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 you're moving all the time, you don't stop and see what you're doing. You keep yeah. on going and keep on going, you don't know whether it's hit anybody or not. If, it, 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 yeah. if you've got this, this area to take over, yeah. and you, you, you're attacking all, all, all the sides, like and, and from and leading tanks. They aim at leading tank, which we, <coughs> which were at leading tank, and it come from a side, side entrance, this, this AK millimeter, it hit it us. We were going that way, and this, this uh, shell come, it, it, it had an engine, blew engine up, because we all bailed out like and set off running away from the tank. And it did, it did uh, blow up then, mm -hmm. so it, it, it must have died out or something. And it infantry went in and broke it all, when, when it, it we done like, they took all the stuff off it. The, because a lot of stuff, all the personal stuff, and that's what they did in infancy. Mm. And if, if, it, uh, if it didn't explode, which might have it would have, would have exploded, but in our case it didn't explode because we saw it tank afterwards. So it, it, we couldn't move it because the engine had blown to bits like that. Uh, it's a weird feeling like that. And, and the second time when it hit us, uh, it was a, a gouge. And you can, nobody can believe this until they see it their own eyes. This said 88 millimeter shell had come through and it, it side a tap and gouge uh, 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 about that deep cut. If I say in three inch, it, it must have gone its side, somehow its side, and it gouge it uh, yeah, and come out just about three yards down there, like, mm -hmm. and side it tap. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't gouge it. Sorry, metal, I did it. That armor piercing shell. We, we never could understand why it didn't explode like that. It just. Cow is like a, a gully at the side. 
minute. Another inch or two that way would have shouldn't have been even against me. Like, it's, just, it's just straight into it. Scary. Mm -hmm. uh, very scary. Hassan's got it with a uh, bullet in, in, inside his head. Jesus. He penetrated. He just hit him and dropped. Oops, it <laughs> dropped off. It must have been a last part bit of flight and it, it hit him there. He fetched blood on the downside here, but it was streamed down like over. He did penetrate, he just broke skin like and bled. It shook him, believe me, it shook him already. He was looking, he managed that effort for about three weeks. Uh, he, he, he is a book here, like that. That's very scary. What happened? Did he, um, did he make a bang or anything, or just...? No, it just hit him and, and dropped like, you know. Did, did, did he say bullet? Ah, well, I kept that. Uh, kept bullet. I kept that stone to go to my jerking, you know, for money up and he just disappeared out of the pocket for some reason. Only about as big as, I said, not as big as a marble, but it went I mean, through my leather jerking, through my middle me back, into my middle me back, and he stuck there like that, and I felt his thud. I said, I've been hit! And then, so he said, I've been hit, right? it was a bloody stone, he said. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It's a penny fit up, let me love you while I'm jer jerking, then let me jerking. Throw my battle dress into me. It didn't touch my skin, it had it, it gone through that. <laughs> and exposure from it, 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 shell hitting ground, going grit up like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I see some funny, funny things. I'm gonna, gonna have a, Probably a cockney here. Nobody liked him, even when he was he was too plausible with his speech, you know, mm. cockney that it was really crap <coughs> people cockney. They don't have to make money and that's the best part of their life, I think. Yeah. And uh, he was a, a corporal tank commander. Uh, the this this uh, officer sergeant <sighs> a corporal each one in charge of a tank and this corporal was in charge of the tank. And uh, we, uh, we we got her into tanks to, to move into this uh, objective light. Suddenly somebody screamed out, <coughs> and when he comes out, he's dropped. Ash on his thumb, chopped his thumb off. And uh, he got sent back to Blighty. They'd done it on purpose. Which he probably had done that. They got away with it. He finished up all that. That's the one back home in England, just lost, lost, lost of his thumb. But uh, he, he was brave a lot of them, but doing that, I mean, who likes to commit suicide or just went wrong to something mm. quick? Fighting, it would have taken a chance, but uh, he, he did. He took a chance and chopped his thumb off and they sent him back to Blackie on the next boat. So. Mm Total gun goes away, you, 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 you've gone in with a machine gun. You mean to know rifle in, in tanks, in, uh, small machine guns, rebel told uh, sting gun. With each for a sting gun apiece, and sergeant is revolver, and he has sergeant dead. <coughs> <coughs> I've got no more war me ever. I don't want to wish it on anybody, but when I think about people fighting other, other people, it's I mean, in, in South Africa, it must be awful. They're, they're killing the random man. Yeah. Okay, well, they just kill his black and kill him. <laughs> yeah. It must be awful, that, that, that country. And now they're, now they're, well, they're trying to, to win or do or whatever. I don't 